What up, everybody? Welcome to the True Men Show. If you got the chance and you don't like hearing me read, please um pause this and read these two um devotions with really important scripture in it. But um, if you want to hear me read it, I'll read it real quick. And um, it says, My ways are mysterious and unpredictable. But they are good when you look at the world events with so much rampant evil. It is easy to feel fearful and discouraged. You cannot comprehend why I allow such cruelty and suffering. The difficulty lies in the fact that I am infinite and you are not. Many things are simply beyond your comprehension, but do not despair. When you reach the limits of your understanding trusting me will carry you onward affirm your trust in me through silent and spoken prayers stay in communication with me don't get trapped in a posture of demanding to know why that is wrong questions to ask me the right questions are how do you want me to view the situation and what do you want me to do right now? You cannot change the past, so start with the present moment and seek to find my way forward. Trust me, and one day, one moment at a time, do not fear, for I am with you. I will strengthen you and help you. That's all for March 9th, and I'm going to read March 10th right now. I forgot to tell you the name of the book is Jesus Always. By Sarah Young, 365 Devotions. Okay, March 10, it says, From the fullness of my grace, you have received the blessings after another. Stop for a moment, beloved, and ponder the astonishing gift of salvation by the grace through faith in me, because it is entirely a gift, not a result of works. This salvation is secure. Your part is just to receive what I accomplished for you on the cross. Believing with the faith that was given you, faith that was given you, this undeserved 